Blessings, 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 beloved. I am Mama Pam, a.k.a. Pamela Dobson, and I do read, beloved, seven minutes every day, so you do not have to read. Today's reading is for August the 18th, 2021. Wednesday, we're reading from Isaiah, the 25th chapter, 26th chapter, and 27th chapter. Reading from the King James Version of the Word of God. And it reads, Lord, Thou art my God, I will exalt thee. I will praise thy name, for thou hast done wonderful things. Thy counsels of old are faithfulness and truth. For thou hast made of a city, an heap of a defense city, a ruin, a palace of strangers to be no city. It shall never be built. Therefore shall the strong people glorify thee. The city of the terrible nation shall fear thee. For thou hast been a strength to the poor, a strength to the needy in his distress, a refuge from the storm, a shadow from the heat, when the blast of terrible ones is as a storm against the wall. Thou shalt bring down the noise of strangers as the heat in a dry place, even the heat with the shadow of a cloud. The branch of the terrible one shall be brought low. And in this mountain, Shall the Lord of hosts make unto all people a feast of fat things, a feast of wines on the lees, of fat things full of marrow, of wines on the lees, well refined. And he will destroy in this mountain the face of the covering cast over all people and the veil that is spread over all nations. He will swallow up death in victory and the Lord will wipe away tears from off all faces. And the rebuke of his people shall he take away from off all the earth. For the Lord hath spoken it. And it shall be said in that day, Lo, this is our God. We have waited for him and he will save us. This is the Lord. We have waited for him. We will be glad and rejoice in his salvation. For in this mountain shall the hand of the Lord rest. And Moab shall be trodden down under him. Even as straw is trodden down from the dung hill, and he shall spread forth his hands in the midst of them, as he that swimmeth spreadeth forth his hands to swim, and he shall bring down their pride together with the spoils of their hands, and the fortress of the high fort of thy wall shall he bring down, lay low, and bring to the ground, even to the dust. Chapter 26. Now in that day, Shall this song be sung in the land of Judah? We have a strong city. Salvation will God appoint for walls and bulwarks. Open ye the gates that the righteous nation which keepeth the truth may enter in. Thou wilt keep him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on thee because he trusteth in thee. Now trust ye in the Lord forever for in the Lord Jehovah is everlasting strength. For he bringeth down them that dwell on high. The lofty city, he layeth it low. He layeth it low even to the ground. He bringeth it even to the dust. The foot shall tread it down, even the feet of the poor and the steps of the needy. The way of the just is uprightness. Thou most upright dost weigh the path of the just. Yea, in the way of thy judgments, O Lord, have we waited for thee. The desire of our soul is to thy name and to the remembrance of thee. With my soul have I desired thee in the night. Yea, with my spirit within me will I seek thee early. For when thy judgments are in the earth, the inhabitants of the world will learn righteousness. Let favor be shown to the wicked. Yet will he not lean righteous, learn righteousness in the land of uprightness? Will he deal unjustly and will not behold the majesty of the Lord? Lord, when thy hand is lifted up, they will not see, but they shall see, and be ashamed for their envy at the people. Yea, the fire of thine enemies shall devour them. Lord, thou wilt ordain peace for us, for thou also hast wrought all our works in us. O Lord our God, other lords beside thee have had dominion over us, but by thee only will we make mention of thy name. They are dead. They shall not live. They are deceased. They shall not rise. 
Therefore hast thou visited and destroyed them and made all their memory to perish. Thou hast increased the nation, O Lord. Thou hast increased the nation. Thou art glorified. Thou hast removed it from, up, from unto all the ends of the earth. Thou hast removed it far unto all the ends of the earth. Lord, in trouble have they visited thee. They poured out a prayer when they chasteneth when, they, when thy chastening was upon them. Like as a woman with child that draweth near the time of her delivery is in pain and crieth out in her pains, so have we been in thy sight, O Lord. We have been with child. We have been in pain. We have, as it were, brought forth wind. We have not wrought any deliverance in the earth. Neither have the inhabitants of the world fallen. Thy dead men shall live together with my dead body shall they arise. Awake and sing, ye that dwell in dust. For thy dew is as the dew of herbs, and the earth shall cast out the dead. Come, my people, enter thou into thy chambers. Now this is my scripture that the Lord has given me for this season. Enter thou into thy chambers, and shut thy doors about thee. Hide thyself, as it were, for a little moment until the indignation be overpassed. For behold, the Lord cometh out of his place to punish the inhabitants of the earth for their iniquity. The earth also shall disclose her blood and shall no more cover her slain. Chapter 27. In that day the Lord with his sore and great and strong sword shall punish Leviathan, the piercing serpent, even Leviathan, that crooked serpent, and he shall lay the dragons that is in the sea. In that day sing ye unto her a vineyard of red wine. I, the Lord, do keep it. I will water it every moment, lest any hurt it. I will keep it night and day. Fury is not in me. Who would set the briars and thorns against me in battle? I would go through them. I would burn them, up, them together. Or let him that hold of strength, that he may make peace with me, and he shall make peace with me. May the Lord add a blessing. May the Lord add a blessing to you, the hearer, me, the reader of this precious and sacred word of God. The Lord is admonishing us to make peace with him. Make peace with him, all you listeners to the word as I'm reading it, because God is moved out of his place. He done moved out of his place in heaven and come down here to earth. And he's come down with fire and hail and brimstones and earthquakes, tornadoes, hurricanes. We're going to read about that later on. Just keep on following with the read. Praise God. I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you for being a part of the Smurf Club. For your continued donation of $20 to paypal.me forward slash Pam Dobson and or dollar sign Mama Pam 23. We are Smurf. Seven minute read family. Seven minute read follow. Just seven minute read faithful folk. We are the fastest growing ministry on the internet that I know, Ministering Truth. We have over uh, 4,000 followers on HAPS, HAPS.TV. So please join us at HAPS, H-A-P-P-S dot TV, forward slash at Pamela Dobson. HAPS, H-A-P-P-S dot TV, forward slash at Pamela Dobson. Know that Jesus loves you. Yes, he does. And know that. Mama Pam loves you. And there's absolutely positive. Nothing you can do about it. Be kind to somebody. Until the next read.